next question, question number three, determine the points are collinear. So we are going to say this is collinear or not, we are going to prove. So here, first you take A, B, C, I mentioned it here. First we'll take A, B here. A, B, you then we'll use the formula. X2 minus X1 whole square plus Y2 minus Y1 whole square. So X2. So if we take this two, X1, Y1, X2, Y2. So X2 minus X1 whole square plus Y2 minus Y1. Y2 minus Y1 whole square. So 2 minus 1 is 1 square, 3 minus 5 is minus 2 square. So answer is 1 plus 4. So we can put this root 5. And next after that AB, then we'll find out BC. BC. Same formula. X2 minus X1 whole square plus Y2 minus Y1 whole square. And here x2 means this now taking b and c so this is x1 y1 x2 y2 so x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square so minus 4 square and minus 14 square so 4 square is 16 and 14 square is 196 so add these two how much 212 then if it make it this one is 212 means 2106 253 so answer is 2 root 53 so after that we'll take your a b b c and next one is a c next one is a c then we'll put the formula same formula x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square so a already we know a is uh, 1 5 and c is minus 2 minus 11 so we'll do the same thing x1 y1 x2 y2 so x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square so minus 3 whole square and minus 16 whole square 3 square is 9 16 square is 256 so i must know 256 minus 200 65 and if I know the square root for this one 265 uh, 5 5s of 25 remain 1 so entries you can make it just keep it like this 